guys, this is Svetlana from Kamui Cosplay and today I'm going to show you my Light Up Nova cosplay from Heroes of the Storm. We started this costume two years ago for BlizzCon, but sadly we had no time to film any progress for the making of video. I took, however, plenty of progress pictures and made a very detailed blog entry on my website. So if you're curious how I made a costume, just check out the link below. Despite of that, I thought it would be actually pretty cool to show you how I get into the costume. And if you want to know how to make amazing LED animations like this, just check out my new LED book. It's actually easier than you think and this honey book will show you everything you need to know. You should totally buy it. And now let's start the video. I sold my bodysuit out of a custom printed fabric Benny designed for me. As you can see, all the wires for the electronics are placed inside the suit. I also made the super sexy cowl, which I will need for my helmet later. To get into the armor, I started with the shoes. These are boot covers that are secured with velcro tape. Next came the upper leg armor. They are built out of EVA foam. I glued them to a piece of fabric, which can be closed using velcro as well. As always, Zelda makes sure that I attach everything properly. Now the shin armor. To light it up, I had to connect the cable from inside the suit. Just like the rest, these are also foam attached to fabric. I simply had to close the velcro and do the same for the other leg too. Now to the little hip pieces. These had to be connected to my circuit as well. As you can guess, they are also attached to the suit with some velcro strips. So far, so good. This was the complete lower part of my costume. Next, I had to slide into my breastplate. This plug below connects it to the hip and leg pieces. Now I close the velcro on the top and the sides. Almost done! The shoulders had to get mounted next and then connected to the back. And finally I put on the gloves and the bracers. These of course had to be wired up too. All the cables of my costume were connected to this central piece on my back. Here I placed the switch to turn it on and change the modes. Yay, it works! I just love the super cool animation. Last but not least, I had to slip into my 3D printed helmet and put the visor on. Let's turn the ponytail on too with a different switch. And yay, this looks great! With the exception of the helmet, the entire costume is actually all EVA foam, which is cheap, lightweight and comfy. I'm super happy how the costume turned out and can't wait to work more with EVA foam. I really hope you liked this short video. Working with LEDs is actually super fun and lights make everything better. You should totally try it out. As always, hit the subscribe button and go to Patreon if you want to support us making more videos. Also, let me know in the comments what you are working on right now and see you next time. Bye bye!